My name is Kira Manousis. I'm an Associate Professor of Ophthalmology at New York Eye and Ear of Mount Sinai. If you're intolerant to contact lenses, unable to wear them, feel that your eyes get greedy, irritated, or dry, um, your visual acuity is not as good as you would like with your glasses, there are other options to consider. One of the options to consider is a refractive lens exchange. This option allows you to take out the lens that's inside your eye, and the lens allows you to focus information to the back of the eye. We could take out your lens and replace it by our plastic lens implant. That implant can have a prescription that you have in your contact lenses or glasses built into the lens. And what's important to know that that lens is there for life. So provided that your prescription has been stable, which is a requirement for one of these surgeries, and your eye is no longer changing, you can have one of these procedures. The procedure generally takes anywhere from 10 to 15 minutes. It's done in the operating room under local anesthesia. You're mostly awake. We take out your lens and we replace it with a plastic implant. That implant can generally give you clear vision either for distance, intermediate or near. Or if you choose an implant that will reduce your dependence on glasses, you can choose a multifocal implant that will give you both distance, intermediate and near. And the choice of a lens will be driven by your everyday needs and a discussion with your physician. Refractive lens exchange is typically done for someone who is not a candidate for laser vision correction or LASIK. And in someone who is intolerant to contact lenses and unable to get good quality of vision with their glasses. It's important to know that once the lens is removed out of your eye, the lens does not grow back and you will never get cataracts. That lens is there for life and whatever prescription you have is most likely there to stay. We generally do refractive lens exchanges in someone any, anywhere from 25 to 50 years old. Um, after 50 years old, we start developing clouding of a lens on the way to developing a cataract, at which point one may consider cataract surgery as opposed to a refractive lens exchange. It is important to know that technology is evolving. So whatever lens of choice that's available today may not be available tomorrow, and there may be advances in this technology so if you are comfortable wearing glasses, you should continue doing so or contact lenses and wait for better technology in the future.